and onwards.
Jaffa. Bunch of chubby. Now we're gonna go to the base of the dam for a few pictures. Then onwards to Bucharest. Once again leaving the pack. Luați larg, întoarceți. Poro up done. We're gonna start heading home.
Tchau. This big mama jamma. Maxim 400 on 10 and a half hours almost 300 kilometers well first of all in terms of fuel consumption uh, we rode pretty easy so about uh, between 70 and 90 kilometers an hour cruising speed and uh, I just filled it up now and did the math it ate 3.4 liters per hundred kilometers which is kind of amazing considering it's supposed to have a fuel consumption of about 4.5 but apparently if you ride it easily at a constant 70-80 uh, kilometers sometimes 90 kilometers an hour it's actually uh, pretty frugal so 3.4 that's what my Symphony ST200 gets in the city and it has uh, I think somewhere around a third of the power. Yeah, a third of the power of the Maxim. Uh, in terms of comfort, let's see. The seat is very nice, and this backrest is very nice. Thing is, I'm short in the legs, and for me, this is enough leg room. For somebody that's taller, mm, I don't know. I don't know exactly so if you're between or I would say a maximum of 1.8 1.8 meters tall you could probably fit very well and be very comfortable on the long journeys uh, otherwise I think taller people may struggle a little bit I'm not sure of it uh, in terms of wind protection in terms of wind protection the screen I had it in the in the up position all the time very nice adequate protection if you look at it in the up position we have it here next to Alp this is where Alp sends this is the Maxim it's somewhere around the same area and you're sitting just just as tall yeah, so wind protection, it's about as good as Alps, which is actually pretty, pretty decent. I was really happy with the wind protection. I wouldn't get a extender, a deflector, something like that. And protection, you could get some hand guards, I don't know exactly, but I didn't feel very uncomfortable with my hands out in the open. The engine, plenty of power, strong. What more there is to say, it's actually a pretty pretty good scooter for long distance riding. Comfortable, the suspension is comfortable, you can find a good riding position if you're not too tall. Fuel consumption if you're, uh, if you're not in a hurry is extremely good. At 
3.4 liters per 100 kilometers this was extremely good and honestly I would recommend it for somebody want to, wanting to do long distance travel if he can fit comfortably if he's not too, too, too long in the legs then yeah this is a very very good long distance cruiser So hope you enjoyed it, thank you so very much for watching, I will be trying to do an, one more video on the Maxim 400, I still have something else I want to test and I want to do one more video on the 400, but until next time, until next video, take care out there and ride safe.